am excited to bring you yet another video where I'm going to be talking about another European country which has released a job seeker visa and is currently taking applications. The name of the country is Sweden and this visa will enable you to travel to Sweden without a job offer to go and search for employment you can even open your own business so this is what i'm going to be talking about in today's video if you are new to my channel my name is pauline popomoyo and in this channel we keep things real without wasting any of your time let's get into it so in this video i'm going to be talking about the sweden job seeker visa i'll be telling you what it is all about what is the eligibility criteria what are the requirements and all you need to know about this sweden job seeker visa so because of shortage of staff more and more european countries are adopting the job seeker visa so the sweden job seeker visa enables you to fly to sweden without a job offer and sweden being the 16th richest country in the world you would love the high standards of living in sweden so what is the swedish job seeker visa so a job seeker visa allows you to enter a country to search for a job so with this visa you can enter sweden and search for a job or start a business in sweden so sweden also has a shortage occupation list and the occupations in demand in sweden are occupations like at primary and secondary school teachers necessary school teachers nurses doctors carpenters electricians engineers ecologists guys the list is endless so to make life easier for yourself before you go to sweden you search for jobs online you can use sites like indeed.com linkedin glassdoor just to mention a few and once you secure a job because you can always do skype interviews zoom interviews whatsapp interviews and so forth and secure yourself a job then go to sweden to look for a job in courts because you would already be having a job i'm just saying this so that you avoid the situation whereby you go to sweden then search for jobs and search for job until your visa expires before you even secure a job don't quote me guys but i'm just telling you a strategy which works so what is the validity of this visa so this visa is valid for a period of the minimum is three months and the maximum is nine months so it's three to nine months that's why i'm saying before you move to sweden make sure you search for jobs online such that when you get there you will not have problems with securing a job so what are the requirements for this sweden worker visa one you need to have a passport you send in digital passport pages showing your name address photo signature passport number issuing country just to mention a few things then you need to have health insurance digital health insurance documents showing that you have a comprehensive health insurance valid for health care undertaken in sweden and this insurance should cover the entire period whether it's three months or nine months of your residence permit so it should also cover cost of emergencies and other medical care in case you get hospitalized in sweden so you attach the terms and conditions for your insurance policy to your job seeker visa application which means when applying for this visa you have to attach your insurance policy as well then thirdly you need to have education documents you need digital copies of your examination certificates digital copies of official transcripts showing the courses included in your education and you will get these transcripts up from your university you will also need to have a digital copy of a signed letter of consent so this consent allows swedish council for higher education the right to contact your higher education institutions 
in your home country in case your examination certificates and official language transcripts are issued in a language other than Swedish or English, you have to have them translated to Swedish or English. Then you enclose those copies of the original document and the translated documents to your application. Number four, for you to apply for this visa, you will also need to have proof of funds so for proof of funds you need 13,000 swedish chroma per month and that is an equivalence of just above a thousand pounds less than 1100 pounds per month so for three months you need 39,000, and for nine months you need 117,000 swedish chroma you also need probably additional funds in case you have to travel back home if you don't secure a job but with the amount of jobs on the market you are highly likely to get a job before your visa even elapses you will also need to have an advanced level degree or higher for you to be able to apply for the swedish work visa and the Swedish Higher Council of Education will verify with your country whether your documents are authentic. You also need to show efforts to seek employment or start a new business. The why I say it's important that you search for jobs, either on LinkedIn, Indeed.com, just to show that you are searching for a job and you are networking. If you are intending to start a business, then you have to have evidence of business plans and supporting documents last but not least you need to be applying for this visa from outside sweden so are you able to bring your family on this visa route no you cannot bring your family with you on this visa route but once you secure a job in sweden your family can always join you so guys this is the wonderful opportunity that i wanted to share with you you can get your documents ready and start applying for the swedish job worker visa as long as you have your adequate funds so this is all that i wanted to share with you guys if you meet the eligibility criteria you go ahead and apply and thank you so much for watching guys don't forget to like, subscribe, and share, and hit that notification bell so that you are the first person to be alerted whenever I upload my videos. Thank you so much for watching, guys. I will see you in my next video.